This is the story of the children of Lear. Read and illustrated by the children of Miss Corrigan's fourth class. Long ago there was a king called Lear. He had four children, Fenula, A, Fikra and Khan. He loved his children very much. The children's mother died and they were very sad. Sometime later, King Lear decided to get married again to a woman called Aoife. However, Aoife was not kind-hearted and she was jealous of the children. She was jealous of the relationship they had with their father. She plotted with a dream on how to get rid of the children forever. One day, Aoife watched the children as they played by the lake. She took out a magic wand and waved it over the children. Suddenly, the children began to grow feathers. Her magic spell had turned them into swans. They would have to spend 300 years on the lake of Derivera. 300 years on the Sea of Moyle. And 300 years on the Isle of Flora. Only the sound of a church bell could break the spell. Lear was devastated when he found out what Aoife had done to his children. The children told Lear that they would have to spend 900 years as swans. Lear was furious and he banished Aoife from the kingdom forever. Lear spent his days talking to his children and telling them stories. Eventually, Lear got old and died. The children were very sad. The swan spent 900 long years on the water. Then one day they heard a church bell ringing. They met a village called Faithful. They told him their story and he sprinkled holy water on the swans and prayed. The four swans began to lose their feathers. They changed into a very old woman and three very old men. Fenula put her arms around her brothers and hugged them. The four of them died peacefully. We woke buried them all in the same grave. He made sure to tell their story to others. We hope you enjoyed our story of the children of Lear.